what is going on guys slash gamer hd here and today i'm kind of reviving the channel as i haven't posted in quite a while so i'll start off my new series of infinite warfare as i pre-ordered it back in may and have beta access now the game only came out yesterday and i was planning to stream but due to me not being able to actually connect which i'm sure you guys heard or seen the youtubers that couldn't connect yesterday i decided to make a video today which fit in quite well with what actually came out as i was about to make the video so in my opinion, this game feels almost identical to Ghosts, which is expected since it's the same developers, but I wasn't expecting it to be this similar. Like, the time to kill is incredibly quick, and most of the time I don't even have time to react, or just the looks of the game in general, like, the colours seemed a bit washed out compared to Black Ops 3, where the colours were more live and bright. So I was expecting a change more like the ones Treyarch made from Black Ops 1 to Black Ops 2, or even Black Ops 2 to Black Ops 3. But yeah, I'm sure you guys have all seen gameplay of it, so I'll get straight to the point of the video, which is what Inf Infinity Ward have just added onto the game at around 6pm UK time. It's crazy as it's only been one day since the game came out, but as the beta only lasts two weekends, well, one for Xbox, I guess they won't delay anything they might add onto the game. So they just released a new game mode, which is a classic kill confirmed, that's been in all the previous Call of Duties. So yeah, the rules of the game remain unchanged, they're the exact same thing as you guys experienced in the previous Call of Duties, um, you get 50 per kill and then you get extra points if you get the tags. And um, there's no delay as, as far as I'm concerned in spawn time. So it will feel just like, well other than the game being different, it will feel just like the other Kill Confirmed you've played in the past. So the gameplay in the background is of Kill Confirmed and Throwback using the Karma 45. It's beast gun in my opinion, like really overpowered. And it's not a great gameplay, it's not really used to the style of the game due to it being so different from, from Black Ops 3 and the games I usually play because I skipped, actually skipped Ghosts after Black Ops 2. So I spent two years on Black Ops 2 and then they went straight to Advanced Warfare. So yeah, you should expect better gameplay in the future. Now, this means that if Infinity Ward is releasing anything else, it should be within a day or two of the beta time. Which could also mean that tomorrow, at the same time, at 6pm, they could add another add on to the game. Whether it's another game mode, another map, or even raising the level cap as people are getting higher and higher in terms of level. Yeah, so I'll be looking forward to see what they have to release next in the game. So make sure you like, leave a comment and subscribe to stay tuned on future videos. I'll see you guys next time.